Hello everybody, it's Gordrick Sodoff here, and I'm going to be showing you the LSAT pack punched in slow motion, it looks epic. Obviously it's not slow motion right now, this is normal speed, as I said in the video, but you guys aren't going to believe how epic this gun is in slow motion. I've just discovered how epic pack punch guns are in slow motion, and I'm going to have so much fun with it uploading these things to YouTube. Hopefully it gets a decent following, but... For some reason, I doubt it will, but still, it's good to have some fun anyway. So here you are. Look how slow it's going. It's ridiculous. It's got such a slow fire rate, this gun. It looks epic when you put it on slow motion. I swear, I was doing a trial on the 1911 in Black Ops 1, and I was shooting faster than that at the slow motion. But it did look epic. You could see the bullet... What's it called? The... Projectile coming out the side of gun and it was pretty awesome to watch but that was just a test I was seeing if 30 frames or 60 frames is better for slow motion as you guys would have guessed it is obviously 60 30 lags a ton and 60 just looks a lot smoother at 0 0.25 times and I just think it's good but if I want to do some simple slow motion I don't need 60 frames a second I'll probably be fine with just using 30 but this is pretty slow, this is slowed down a fair bit, so I do need 60 for this. I pack-a-punched it twice because I cannot stand that target finder sight on zombies. It's useless, there's no point to it, and it takes too long to aim with. I just want, I just went for the simple red dot sight, that's all you need guys. I think that's really all you need. But, it just obliterates the zombies, and in slow motion you see all the mistakes I make. I almost died there, I was pretty lucky, I was like, oh shit, don't go down again, because I already went down like twice and I was pretty pissed. But, I'm happy now, because I got the gameplay, and unfortunately we're coming to the end of our video, that's the site which I was using, it's not accurate, but you don't need to be that accurate with zombies, it's not like you're aiming at them from 50 kilometers away, but anyway, in the comments below, leave what gun I should pack punch and do a slow-mo of. I would really appreciate comments, because they give me some ideas on what I could do, or maybe in the comments leave what I should do in the future with my slow motion. Might do multiplayer one day, but I think let's leave it at pack a punch guns, because they look epic. I should do the Wonder Waffle DG3, they'll look epic with its gold camo on Black Ops. Anyway guys, see you later, don't forget to subscribe.